Okay, part number two. So you understood that uh, from our lens uh, depends our arch uh, percent. So, uh, uh, so you uh, have to remember this uh, part of our lesson. Uh, and uh, I would like to explain one more thing uh, that uh, when we are doing our nails for competition we need to do our nails like round I'm talking about inside arch cross arch and arch top arch <coughs> And uh, when we are working with salon nails, when we are working with our school nails, our arch uh, a little bit different. So, look, it's one side, another one side, and round. For what we are doing this type of the arch? Because our natural nails, look in your natural nail, I... I um, don't have but look in your natural nail you don't have a uh, natural nail arch like round it's impossible it's not uh, usual and uh, what i can say more that uh, that our natural nails uh, have this type of arch like one side another one side and round you see difference for when you are in competition you need to do this one when you are in uh, salon nails you need to do this one why uh, yes i told you about uh, natural nails that our natural nail uh, nails arch uh, not the same like round but in these places we put more material so this arch is more um, stability more power and more stronger than this one so this is more flexible arch when we are talking about arch and here i uh, did um, um, natural nail in this side and look one more time one part another one part and round and not like round round it's uh, something like round so uh, for us we need to do this one type of the arch how we can do it uh, we have uh, two uh, two variants how we can do it uh, when we are working with uh, mm, paper forms I have paper forms it's the same looking in uh, video but they are not the same because it's paper look not not clear or oh, here is uh, mm, plastic clear this difference so, when we are working with um, paper forms, we can do it, but we have only one possibility to do it. I'll cut you and this one side. And I will do uh, my this one piece of uh, aluminium. I will glue here. And uh, what we need to do, we need to do to use this uh, stickers. Different colors and different sizes. What else? But you understood, yeah? Uh, one more different colors different sizes in our company uh, we have black all but different sizes too so when we 
uh, need to do this arch we need to uh, push here then unite our these two parts but very correctly you see uh, one one by one here you see if you are doing something like this it's not correct and inside your arch will be uh, will look in one side more so every time when you are gluing uh, when you are gluing your uh, forms you need to glue here very correctly I'm talking about these two places so then for example it's my nail I applied form here for example yeah I need to glue these places very correctly not correctly but so and I use this one part then I push here you see but when you're looking inside my art now you can see that my art on the top and in the middle uh, not in the middle in uh, inside um, is too much like round so I need to do like this a little bit and then arch become more like I'm talking about one side another and like round so when I'm do my modeling for example uh, from here on the top till here yeah I'm doing correctly not like round but when we are working with uh, plastic forms we do it at once look in my arch inside we do not use this aluminium at all and we can get our correctly arch inside look you see it's at once one side another side and we don't have here uh, arch inside and on the top uh, like round we have this correct arch but let's repeat to understand me this type of the arch is correct too but uh, it's only for competition when you are working with salon nails you have to do nails more stronger so this type of the arch because we put inside more material on this one places for us will be more uh, stronger in salon nails we work and we are fighting of uh, to do our nails more stronger for example uh, when your customer do some cleaning opening cars and i don't know opening doors uh, and so on our nails have to be very very strong so that's why we need to choose this type of the arch uh, and if you don't understand something now you need to stop your video and repeat your video to understand one more time to listen one more time and to fix everything what I'm uh, what I told you so uh, the second one part of our lesson will be uh, that that we will talk about square first day it's for us square short salon nail square because it's the most simple form and to understand everything we need to start every time from square like my nails so 
when we are talking about square our nail inside you see my uh, nails uh, I'm doing apex remember it's the same every time apex here stress zone stress zone here our fridge sorry I forgot to tell you this one places I forgot to tell you how uh, how we can call our uh, sides of arch inside inside of our arch we can we have concave name concave on the top we have another one name convex so uh, for us uh, very important uh, of the nail parts is to uh, are two places inside arch and top arch so concave and convex and uh, mm -hmm. when we are doing our uh, square we need to do apex stress uh, free edge i'm talking about this end of the fridge uh, it's one line and nail going straight then when we are working with a low lateral parallel here it have to be straight too but two lines it's two parallels remember from school what is it two parallels it's uh, lines where never cross so for us it's two parallels here when we are apply for example here file we need to get here uh, corners of 90 percent understood me look when i apply for example here it's soft square more my nails when i apply here uh, file Mm -hmm. my camera okay when I apply here my uh, my uh, file what I'm getting here I'm getting here corners you see it's not so correctly because it's uh, so square but when we are putting file like this we need to get here everywhere like uh, red color i mm, i did uh, so we have to get here 90 percent of uh, our corners of course it's only scam it's not um, like uh, real life because our nature uh, our nails uh, are more like uh, rounds for example but in scheme you can understand that in picture that here uh, uh, I have uh, corners so two lines uh, parallels and here very correctly corner when we are working with uh, when we are looking on our nail not like this when we are looking on our nail like this position uh, we see that we have here two parallels you see it's two parallels one parallel this one side you see now it's very correctly here uh, on my nails here one parallel you see I put inside my file and now I can check it everything that uh, here inside we have parallel and from another one part we have two parallels you see you can understand it that it's two parallels so when we are uh, um, working we need to do uh, two parallels and uh, here I wrote distances uh, between this part and this part have to be the same distance understood me because here's two parallels so the distance have to be the same and I can say you that nails it's really mess 
it's really geometry, but it's not something from art. When we are doing some example, for example, when we are gluing uh, Swarovski, uh, when we have some paint on nails, yes, it's art. But when we are working with modeling, it's only mess here. So, uh, to understand me, you need to understand some mess rules that parallels and uh, we are working with parallels every time. So, uh, here I have four pictures with uh, correctly, not so correctly uh, nails. Uh, here, this one, you see, one side, one parallel, another one parallel. And you see that it's not parallels here. So, when we are talking about square, Yes, correctly square about rules of the square. This shape I can't uh, call uh, square because this shape is ballerina. It's very uh, popular uh, shape now, but the ballerina have uh, has to have must to have uh, about uh, thirty percent of arch inside. Understand me? About this percent of arch inside. When you see in Instagram, Facebook, a lot of ballerina nails, but you see that they are straight. They are, um, they do, uh, don't have these nails, these pictures. Um, they don't have uh, arch in, uh, at all inside. So it's not correctly. And when you're doing your ballerina, you need to do arch inside too. Uh, here is a very big mistake. And every time when it's not parallels, it's become like triangle, but going somewhere here and cross here. You see this parallels and distances here and here very different. You understood me, yeah? Of course, uh, I uh, did here um, uh, on my picture very long nails. But in our life, for example, I saw a lot of uh, examples like here. For example, very short nails. You see? It's very short nails. But... You see, I see here that it's not correctly. Nail go in and become more fat nail. For example, this one, my nail, it's like this, but a little bit. You see, I put here one uh, file and here I put another one side to the file. And somewhere my lines, what I imagine they uh, cross together so so for us it's not correctly it's not correctly it's uh, it's it's a very big mistake when we do nails like this then another one mistake when uh, distance here i'm talking about inside in the middle distance uh, this distance is more, uh, is bigger, or here less, and nails become like uh, like cakes. I don't know. Uh, for example, very short nail. You see, very short nail, and here uh, the most um, usual mistake when you do your filing, you do this mistake, and nails become like this. Uh, so, nail here uh, more thinner, here too more thinner, or here too much material. You see, it's mistakes for us. And when nail correct, uh, very correct, so two parallels here and here, uh, distances correctly, and we have this nail. So, 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 what else? 
I have another one picture what I did. Um, it's um, how to apply forms. How to apply forms. Uh, and how to do it correctly. And you see uh, in uh, Facebook, YouTube, a lot of videos where forms they apply like this. Look. For example, when I apply my form like this position, and another one position. For example, like this. For example, this position. It's uh, very rude, but I would like to show you. Look, it's every time when you glue here or something, for example, like this. You see, my form every time look uh, in uh, more down. For us, it's not correctly because when we are doing uh, form more down inside we are trying inside i'm talking inside arch we are trying in our uh, filing to do our nails more thinner to do this one part more thinner and more natural and when we are filing we every time filing on ourselves every time like this To do our this one part more thinner and uh, it's automatically that we remove and file this part or for us part remember this is stress zone stress zone so this stress zone uh, we're filing in not enough material here become not enough material and that's why our nails, uh, they are not so strong that we need. <coughs> Sorry. But when we are working with this position of the form, you see, <coughs> when my, uh, when my uh, form looking in uh, a little bit up, we uh, here, have here inside like hole where we can put more material you see so here and here stress yeah uh, you can compare now and understand that here more material so this one uh, history is more stability and uh, this nails more strong for uh, our life and please pay attention it's very very important that never when you are doing like this you glue till the end they are never cross they are never gluing so i can do like this to remember for you that uh, we never uh, we never can't uh, we never can't do like this position we never can uh, glue uh, uh, here uh, this part of our form but pay attention here when you see this yeah i can say it's not glue it's everything is okay but when you do your job till the end like here you can understand that they glue together and distance here I'm talking about this one distance have to be every time more than 1.5 centimeters you see so very big distance 
Uh, this one scam for us will be tomorrow, uh, the day number two, and uh, this uh, scams too. And with Sari, it's uh, enough for today. And I will show you on practice now how uh, we will work with forms and we will uh, continue our work.